Night fell suddenly, and his heart beat fast. His throat went dry as he realized that he hadn't reached the Abbot Road. The trees were still thick, and the road was still narrow. The Abbot Road was broader, and there the sky wasn't screened by branches. But here, one could hardly see the sky. The stars gleamed through the occasional gaps ahead. He quickened his pace, though he was tired. He ran a little distance, his feet falling on leaf-covered ground with a sharp rustling noise. The birds in the branch saw head stared at this noise and fluttered their wings. In the deep darkness and stillness, the noise of fluttering wings had uncanny ghostly quality. Bob was frightened and stood still. He must reach the Abbot Road and thence find his way home. He would not mind even if it were twelve o'clock when he reached the Abbot Road. There was something reassuring in the spaciousness and in the sparseness of vegetation. But here, the closeness of the tree trunks and the branches intertwining at the top gave the road the appearance of a black, bleak cavern with an evil spirit brooding over it. <laughs>